All right, y'all, we're back here in my little nest at the White Elephant Pub in Inglewood, Florida. And what we're looking at today is a Neptune. Let me bring this light down here. Drop some stuff while I'm grabbing the light. It is a Neptune outboard engine. And I'm going to try and get all the letters in there to where you can read them. Um, Muncie Gear Company, model number 10A2. And the gas tank's here for it, but it got painted, uh, uh, it's got a red paint on it, and somebody didn't, that's got to do it. <clears throat> but uh, the motor is really nice for its age. I'm not sure of the vintage or the year or the. Um, Grease, UW. Oh. Sorry, I'm sitting here reading this stuff. Trying to get it to where y'all can read it too. Maybe freeze the frame or something. I don't see a horsepower on there, but I'm guessing about a half, maybe one. <laughs> no, 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 ain't much bigger than that. That would be the fuel inlet. Pet cock. Mm, big old spark plug. Lower unit. And prop doesn't look like it's uh, done too well there. What else we got here? Ah. He's seen me! Ah. How are you, buddy? Hey, you go. 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 Very little on it to go wrong. Let me see if I can put this sucker back up here without making anything else fall. And there's another little toy out here that's nautically oriented. This is, uh, my understanding is that it's from the 50s. I haven't looked it up or nothing. I ain't gonna. This is cool. But this is an old wooden boat model. It's in very, very good shape. No, it's empty, man. I was looking for some type of markings. Looks like it was made in the 50s. Yeah, there is some there parking to it. Seven A right there. T. You know what that looks like? That looks like one. Of, it used to be one of them wooden kits or something. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't. It looks like it was a model. Yeah, that's model what I was thinking. Kit. It was like a model kit from like the fifties, maybe the sixties. Cool as heck, whatever it is. Yeah. So did you bring it in or somebody else? No, uh, Glenn got it with a, another motor like that one over there. Yes, yeah, I've got the motor in the office, office there. Um, and you're going to yeah. hang this on the wall. Yeah. Well, you're going to mess up one of my cameras? That's all right. It'll look better. <laughs> <laughs> Missing its prop and uh, rudder. Yeah. But hell, it's, I'm surprised it's lasted this long and, and not good shape. Oh, no kidding, that is pretty. Somebody took a lot of time putting that together. Yeah. Yeah, and you can tell because when I'm looking over it, it doesn't have it doesn't have any modern screws. Yeah, it's all blue. Yeah. And brads, I noticed a couple. I think I noticed these are brads. Yeah. That's loose. I didn't mean to tap on it. Yeah, it looks like these are all glued on. That looks like they might be brads. Yeah, I thought it was going to That's not going to focus for me. Better my eyes are messed up. But. Yeah, it's cool as hell. Makes me want the real thing. Don't let me don't let me go across the streets of the marina. <laughs>
Hmm. Well, it's good. I mean, I know there was Chris Craft like that, but a century. So maybe, possibly, it's a model of a boat other than a Chris Craft. Pretty as so. hell. Anyway, we'll have our show later.